Insults and over-the-top outrage is standard for Russia state TV talk shows, but this episode was especially ferocious, with the target Canada's ambassador to Moscow. People like her will be banished to hell, where they'll burn eternally, screamed the deputy speaker of Russia's parliament. Ambassador Alison Leclerc flew a rainbow flag outside of Canada's embassy and posted this video to mark June as Pride Month. But she also included a comment on Russia's about to be adopted ban on gay marriage. And proposals for constitutional amendments that, if adopted, would lead to an increasingly less inclusive national legal framework. When she gives directions on voting, said the Kremlin connected journal editor, that's not the role of a diplomat. She should be reprimanded. The amendments would allow Vladimir Putin to remain as president practically until he dies, but they'll also entrench so-called traditional conservative values into the Constitution. I will repeat it again, while I'm president, we will not have parent number one and parent number two, said Putin, it will be mom and dad. At St. Petersburg's Rainbow Cafe, Karina Kuznetsova and her partner Yulia Potikina say while a growing number of Russians believe gay people should have equal rights, it still feels like they're decades away from being completely accepted. This will take us back to the 16th century is how I see it. There's practically no doubt the Kremlin will get its way when the votes are counted Wednesday. Copies of the new constitution have already been published. Chris Brown, CBC News, Vancouver.